Hey guys, it's good to see you all. Yeah. What do you think? Can't think about <laughs> <laughs> All right, so we back is yet another awesome moment to mm -hmm. dine with creativity. Yes. And this is Creative Hub. We are live on Streamhouse TV. As usual, this is where we discover and unveil creativity. And today, um, the creativity we have on the show today is, is, is more than creativity. It's, know, it's something I don't think you would have ever expected. Beyond creativity. <laughs> yes. You know, because mm -hmm. it's mind-blowing. Give me more English. It's, it's, it's supernatural. Yeah. It's Supernal. amazing. Cosmic. It's okay. Kunko. It's okay. It's okay. So, uh, guys. <laughs> right. That's great. So, um, today we have a great artist mm -hmm. in the house. Yep. And then I want you to stay tuned. Mm -hmm. Once again, we want to say thank you for your subscription, thank yes. you for your comment, thank you for your likes right from the beginning. Mm -hmm. You guys have been amazing. You've been and amazing. Today, today I, I wanted to show us love, okay? Don't forget to subscribe, don't forget so to drop much your love comments, from and you don't guys. forget to share. Let's get to reach a lot of people. Let's mm -hmm. get to reach out to a lot of people and let's get to sound this campaign about art. So, um, today, what should you expect, you know? Expect something different, yeah, okay? Yeah. And it's something you wouldn't want to watch alone. Yeah, I so know, I know, I know. Some people are expecting a dance battle. Oh, question. Okay, wait. You know, we've been dancing. Hey, hey Jimmy Kakra. Hey, sorry, we've been joking so much. <laughs> <laughs> so guys, yeah, so today, today, I mean, today, today, it's going to be great. It's going to be great. You, right. it's something I don't know. Me name's Okra. I won't be there. I don't know. I won't be there. In fact, me come not sit down. Charlie, you know, I won't be there. So just stay tuned, guys. Stay tuned. Yeah, yeah. So uh, we're going to go on a quick break, and yes. then when we come back, we have an artist in the studio, and he's going yes. to share with us amazing, amazing, and mind blowing yeah. creativity. Don't forget, this is Creative Hub, and we are live on Streamhouse TV. My name is D Worthy, and I'm right here in the studio with my course. No, 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 wait, wait, wait. We're your favorite girl, no, no, Mabel. Girl. We'll be right back. <laughs> Beautiful works of art, neatly arranged to color the sky together. It's a masterpiece. We are bringing with different shades of artists who are leaving their footprints in the sands of time, creating hope with their faint brushes, inciting peace with their melodies, and transforming hearts with their words. Let us get to know them, the inspiration behind why they do what they do. So catch us live on Streamhouse TV every Friday at 5 p.m. as we discover a you know, new creativity right here in the great club. Hi, stay tuned. Do you easily catch a code and then you find love? Do you have worries about whether you would ever find that special love you deserve and you see? Have you challenges of any sort about love and relationship matters? Join your love and relationship aspects and myself, the love doctor, as we sit round the table of love to dissect the neaties and greeties of love. Right here, be it the good, the bad, and the ugly, live this and every Friday, 7 to 8 p.m. on Streamhouse TV, YouTube, and on Streamhouse GH, Facebook. The Love Life Show with the Lalong. It is what it is. And it is purely love. All right, all right, all right, all right, all right, all right. So you are welcome back to the show. This is Creative Hub, and we are live on Streamhouse TV. Um, like I said earlier, today what we're gonna see is mind blowing, more than creativity. And I have with me in the studio. A fine gentleman, you know, very fine, fine like myself. Now. <laughs> All right, you welcome. Thank you very much. Yeah. Yeah, 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 yeah. I, I hope you are feeling the vibe. You know? Yes. And Great vibe, yeah. We are, we are honored to have you. Right here. Thank you. Yeah. Thanks for, thanks for passing by. <laughs> You're welcome. All right, you know, um, 
my viewers are confused right now, mm. right? They don't know what you are here to do because they, they don't see any dance, they don't see anything. But <laughs> today is also another form of uh, creativity we, we, we're going we're gonna to build right here. All right, so um, uh, can you tell us about yourself? Okay. You can, you can, I don't know your name. Okay. <laughs> Yeah, so we start with that. Uh, I'm Benjamin Ansa. Um, an artist, um, and I call myself um, an applied artist. That is one, yes. Um, it happened that most of my works have got something doing. Um, I really don't do so much of um, still art in terms of having to, I mean, though painting, you still go through a process to get painting done. But um, at the end of my work, um, it should be moving, it should be lightening up, it should have something ongoing with it. Yeah, so that is it. Um, um, aside that too, I am a chorister. Uh, chorister. Yeah. Wow. I'm a cellist and a violinist as well. <laughs> yeah. wow. And so yeah, basically, I'm, I think I'm in the art field more and a little bit of academia. Yeah, that's wow. it. Yeah, thank academia. you. Academia. <laughs> Yeah, you know, he's a PhD student, you know. <laughs> right. So today, Charlie, we have... So um, can you tell us what you do, um, some of your ways? What okay. have you been up to as an artist? Okay. Uh, so um, this whole fountain, I, I, I'm, I'm currently doing aquariums and fountains okay, now. Okay, so um, he's into aquarium and fountains. Fountains, yes. Yeah, so... Um, who aquarium that? Uh, let me show you. Uh, right here on Crazy Bar, you know. <laughs> Aquarium yeah. and fountain. Yes. Uh, aquarium, no. I I am I am I am I am I I am 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 I Stuff yeah. coming and then choral music as well, so yeah. for the singing. But then I, 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 I also saw um, on your page you are good with designing bags and oh Yes, um, and, I, and I do leather, leather products as well, yeah. so footwear yeah. and bags and body oh. accessories, um, basically, yes. Footwear, bags. bags. Oh, guys, if you need footwear and bags, <laughs> and then you'll be bia of your heart, be bia of her. <laughs> everything, everything. So, <laughs> all right, that's great. So, um, we have some few comments. Um, Lodina is dancing. Lodina, thank you for your comments. <laughs> All right, and uh, Ofori says, wow. Thank you, guys. Um, keep your comments coming. Keep your comments coming. Show some love to our brother. So um, I want to know um, why, why, why um, aquarium and fountain? Why, yes. why do you do what you are okay. doing? You know? um, so personally, I think I'm drawn more into freedom. Uh, I call art more of freedom because um, it allows you to express yourself well and not have all the restrictions and don't do this, don't do that. And so um, art has been my thing. Um, I actually wanted to be a pilot, but I think um, some few consultations, art um, came up as a second option. So doing water fountains only came up um, as a result of some course outlines were given uh, that were given us um, in school yeah. during my undergraduate in KMST, and we were given the opportunity to use the aluminum utensils, which is the that they send out, you know, outside yeah, yeah, yeah. to create something. And then um, I challenged myself to create a water fountain with a car for a pump. Can't get to see my father who created the four pump for me, yes, and uh, it came out successful, um, but. Um, in my final year, I was convinced or encouraged by my lecturer, Dr. Kafi Kwesi Ajiman, there, um, to continue with the utensils. So we came up with a model, a very big model as well. I had my teammates, which is Timothy Helm, Israel. And um, from that time, I became a service personnel to the. Yeah. And from that time, I was approached by some friends to create some fountains for them, and I chose to keep going on with the fountain business. The idea for the utensils was to help that particular industry to yeah. just keep so coming I, up I, I, with I it. Think, I think people are confused right now. Let's just take a look. Let's take a look at some okay. of your works. Yeah, so as you can see, as you can see, as you can see, wow, this, this, this is great. So um, this is an aquarium, right? Yeah, that's yeah. an aquarium. Yeah, that's, that's right there on the screen. Wow. 
So you actually created that? Um, yes, I did. Wow. That is beautiful. And the aquariums came up um, as a result of the fountain and, and too as well. This, this, um, the food was. Yes. Wow. That's, that's great. And then, so um, you, you combine the aquarium and the fountain? Or yes. Sometimes you them okay, so um, initially I, start, I was combining the aquarium and the fountains, but I decided to break away from the fountains a little bit. Um, not so much of any special reason, but the fountains are a little tedious to make than an aquarium to me. Uh, so um, basically, that's it. But it's still in the uh, fused up in the businesses. Yes. Wow, that's that that's great, guys. So as you can see, um, these are some amazing work. No, you know, this is so great. This is amazing. Like it's it's beautiful, you know. <laughs> and the fish you see inside, <laughs> and that toy fish. Oh, <laughs> So, um, all right, so today he's going to show us something live on the show. All right, something live on the show. <laughs> and um, I wanted to stay to you, don't say the channel, this is Creative Hub, and you are watching us live on Streamhouse TV. And today we have Benjamin Ansan with us in the studio, an artist, um, and then he's really sharing with us amazing stuff. As, as you saw from the screen, some of his works is really, really, really great. It's really amazing. So, um, uh, today, what do you have for us? So today, um, <laughs> Basic aquarium, um, basic aquarium info, and then basic fountain care info as well. And then um, would I would put up or assemble uh, an aquarium fountain, um, a basic one. Um, I started, but would complete it here. Yes, so, um, something you can make out of your household wow. items. Yes. Oh wow! Aquarium. All right. So if you <laughs> want to um, maybe in your own comfort, you want to you know gather some few stuffs and make your own aquarium. Just stay tuned, all right? So um, how long is it going to take, like? Oh, um, say 10 minutes 10 to minutes. put together, yes. All right, so <laughs> that's great. I want to just stay tuned, all right? Stay tuned. We are taking a quick break to set up, and then when we come back, um, Benjamin is going to show us something live on the show. We're going to have a, 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 a little dis display of his creativity, all right? So um, I want you to stay tuned. Don't forget to subscribe. Don't forget to subscribe. And please drop your comments. Keep dropping your comments. And don't forget to share as well. All right. And this is Creative Hub. We are live on Streamhouse TV. And we will be right back. Human beings are like a rainbow of many colors. It's unique in a way that reflects life. Beautiful works of art neatly arranged to color the sky together. It's a masterpiece. We are bringing with different shades of artists who are leaving their footprints in the sands of time, creating hope with their paint brushes, inciting peace with their melodies, and transforming hearts with their words. Let us get to know them the inspiration behind why they do what they do. So catch us live on Streamhouse TV every Friday at 5 p.m. as we discover the you know, creativity right here in the Great Love. I Do you easily catch a code and then you find love? Do you have worries about whether you would ever find that special love you deserve and you see? Have you challenges of any sort about love and relationship matters? Join your love and relationship experts and myself, the love doctor, as we sit round the table of love to dissect the neaties and greeties of love. Right here, be it the good, the bad, and the ugly, live this and every Friday, 7 to 8 p.m. on Streamhouse TV, YouTube, and on Streamhouse GH, Facebook. The Love Life Show with the Lalong. It is what it is. And it is purely love.
All right, so we should welcome back to the show. This is Creative Hub, and you are watching us live on Stream House TV. Now, this is where we discover and unveil creativity. And I have um, Benjamin still in the studio. I set up a fair fit. So, Ben, as you yes. can see, yeah, he's going to show us, you know, something, something live on the show, all right? Uh -huh. Yes, if, guys. If, if you've not seen an aquarium before, what will be that? Me me hope it Me hope it Today is the first time. Today is the first time. Yeah, say me church when we so. Oh, please. Me me hope it out. Share. Me hope it Guys, see, I have my pen and my book here. I'm going to learn how to set up an aquarium. Yeah. So I'm going to give you a free. So guys, free free tutorials. Free tutorial. Pick your pen and write. All right. So. Stay tuned. Don't forget to comment, show yes, some love. Please. Don't forget to subscribe and mm -hmm. don't forget to share as well. So yes, guys. let's set up very quick. Straight on. Then um, over mm. to you. What are you going to show us? All right. So uh, like I said earlier, we are making um, an aquarium and a fountain together. Okay. Yes. So the basic items, like I said, you can have pieces of wood um, for the shade. This okay. is a flower vase. Flower vase. Yes. You could have these little plastic flower vase or cups if yeah. you want mm -hmm. in the house. And then the normal um, lighting system, which is the, um, the holders mm -hmm. and then the bulb. Mm -hmm. And then you connect your wire if you can in the house. Yes. yes, and then you can have the normal styrofoam that you have. That's a styrofoam. Yeah, that's wow. styrofoam. Or um, like some color. Yes, so yes. styrofoam and then you can choose to design whichever um, way you want it. Yeah. And oh, the yeah. rest is about spraying and painting. Mm -hmm. So that is it. And then to to add your stones and all other stuff, you can use glue, adhesives, glue. preferably okay. silicone glue or okay. wow. glue gun. Yes. Okay. And then we have so this lamp and then the others were built already. So you can buy a glass bowl if you want, or any other container you think mm -hmm. you, you can have as well. Yeah. So basically these are the and then we'll have the foliage which is the I uh, um Artificial plants mm -hmm. that you have around and our fish. Yeah. Yes, that's the most important Hi. thing. You need your fish. All right, so we have a fish. <laughs> yes, fish. which I'm taking home after here. <laughs> Benjamin, <laughs> right? Taking home. Please. Oh! I'm not going to do anything. There is I'm laughing. Taking the fish. I'm taking the fish. Maybe I'm done. Uh. Okay, so let's, yeah. let's, 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 let's combine yes, some guys, fish. Yes, we are ready. Right. Let's start cooking. Sammy, so please don't touch anything. Hey, I won't touch anything. Okay, don't so touch anything. Um, for the sake of time, um, these things have been built already. So what we need to do is to add just a little of the stuff to your satisfaction and then um, you are good to go. So we have a pump in there. Normally to conceal pumps um, in aquariums or in water fountains, it's advisable to use a foliage if you have any of them. Yes. So this is an already prepared foliage that we have there. And so that will be placed just directly behind in front of the pump just to conceal it. Yes, and then we have a little tree here, if you want, to your satisfaction natural, again. Artificial. No, this is artificial. Oh, okay. yeah, so you can crop it to whichever size you want. So this has been done already. And then you can fix it. Because it's styrofoam, you can fix it yeah. anywhere you want. Mm -hmm. Yes, wow. and then we have another, probably here. Okay, so we could have done more paintings on it with the green, um, but as you've seen it, this is uh, an acrylic paint will be suitable for um, works like this because it's about water. Okay. Yes, and so here we move straight to the aquarium proper, and then we have the sand, which is the stones for the aquariums. Mm -hmm. Yes, if you want to call it that way. As you gently pour it into your bowl. So, wh wh where did you get this? Oh, well, you can, if you don't want to go buy this, normally you can get this from the terrazzo shops. Those who, those who sell the terrazzo stones, or you can go to the sea and then directly pick it up. Please go to the sea. We have, we have <laughs> water somewhere. <laughs> so, so if, if that's the case, then you can just go to the terrazzo <laughs> shops. Yes, it's not so, so yeah, possible. Yeah, so please, those in the Africa, you, you, you can go to the beach. <laughs> please, if you are in America. Then, just go and buy um, it. We don't you want can to choose to <laughs> decorate with your stones or shells. Some of the shells are sold. Some too you can still get from the beaches. Oh, okay. Yes. That's, that's great. 
Yeah. And then we pour in our water for Ooh. the bowl. Ooh. Can I pour in the fish when you are done? No, 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 no. No, 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 uh, sticking out like this. Normally, it would be prudent if you hide the wire of the pump as well. Yes. And so, we have our lamp okay. here already built. And you can set it up like wow. that. Wow. So, let that be light. Let's see how. So, it's about conduit stuff. So, this is the tube that is connected. Behind, so the styrofoam, because styrofoam you can perforate um, at any point, you can just drill holes behind just to conceal the whole thing and then pass your tube. So we have passed a tube behind, which is the head, which is normally in a fountain would no normally be called a distributor. And this will be the reservoir in the fountain. So this is what we have now. Now let's turn it on and see um, the effectiveness of the pump and how the pump is going to work. So the pump is going to recirculate uh, to keep circulating oh, the water. Right. I'm not having this right it. now. Yes. Oh, you've not seen that before. I have <laughs> hey, on TV. Ah, wow. Who will be that? Ah, who will be that? Ah, who Okay, so here we are. Uh, fountain working as a system. <laughs> So, oh, my, my sister wanted to put in Yay! the fish. Yay! I do! I do! <laughs> so you teach me how it's done. Uh, yes, yeah. good. So, so please, first please. of all, mm -hmm. a proper aquarium care would require that you put some filters, especially when you don't have proper filters for aquarium or air pumps for aquarium. So these are filter patches you can get from anywhere. Mm -hmm. And then you just slice just some little in the cut them and just let them flow on the water. Mm -hmm. Yes. At least it would help you help yourself absorb or help the, the whole tank system absorb some of the dirt from the water as well. And then the best is to the best to keep uh, your fishes alive more is to have salt, which is um, salt from the sea, not iodated salt. <laughs> yeah, so <laughs> yeah, so <laughs> yes. So um, normally, what the iodated salt does um, is to help you, uh, or to help the fish clear off every bacteria or any other um, disease that is going to worry the fish. Mm -hmm. So it's prudent to have salt in your water. Mm -hmm. Now, someone will ask, what proportion do you have in your water? So it's um, one liter of water per just a, a, a teaspoon um, a teaspoon of salt or that grinded salt or you can just pick about say four or five of the crystals and just drop it in the water it's just going to dissolve in the water yes and um, one last thing about aquarium care is to always watch your water and make sure at least every week you should be cleaning your tank at least every week you should make about a 50 percent water change a 50 percent water change just means just take part of your water out half of it and just replace it at least your fishes will feel okay and fine yeah. fishes are living things and so you must uh, learn to teach them or must learn to help them in that in that context as well yes and so this is our aquarium and our fountain together today we chose an aquarium and a fountain because uh, that has been what I've been doing. But uh, for the first time, I'm also making this for the first time. Wow. You know, exactly. So yeah. So uh, for a fountain care as well, just make sure your pump is always working. Just make sure you clean your pump as well. Though the pump is not a living thing, but the pump gathers debris at the end of the day. So it's prudent that you clean your pump almost every every week too as well, if you want. Yeah. So um, today, this is what you have. And I think our sister wants oh. to do us the honest to just drop the fish. So <laughs> <laughs> dropping a fish into a fish bowl or a fish tank <laughs> is very, very, very crucial and very important. Okay. Important in the sense <laughs> you must be able to wait for some time for the water to run and then clear every other passage or every other pathway um, that is, uh, the water is passing um, through, which is the pump itself. If you don't and there uh, are any debris and you directly introduce the fishes right away, they will die. Mm. Secondly, you must not use 
um, water from the taps because they have chlorine in there. The chlorine will instantly kill the fishes right away. So if you still want to use water from the tap, fetch the water down for a day and then pour. At least the chlorine will settle before. The most suitable water for an aquarium is well water because it's well oxygenated mm -hmm. as well, yes. Or a borehole, but the borehole would still require that at least you run it for some number of hours before you introduce your fishes. Mm -hmm. Introducing fishes to new fishes to an old tank also means that quarantine the new fishes you are bringing because you do not know the diseases it's coming f um, with from the tank you bought them from. <laughs> yeah, so it's very, very crucial when you're introducing your fishes to a tank an old tank or a new tank. Mm -hmm. These things are very crucial and you must take very good notice of them. Okay. So I think <coughs> our fish is used to the whole water system now, yeah. though there is no salt, mm -hmm. um, but we are going to drop the fish today. Okay. And it's good to use the net to catch the fish and put the fish in the bowl. Okay. Any other thing is cruel, but I think today we may go through a little bit of the cruel way, Whoa. which is to pour the fish into the <coughs> bowl. So first of all, I think what the water, the fish um, is in already is a little too much. Okay. So we'd pour some out. Okay. Then our sister would do us the honors by just introducing the fish to okay. our new volunteer we have here. <laughs> so okay. <laughs> okay. okay. Yes. So today we have here the Japanese koi fish. Japanese and what? Koi fish, K-O-I. <laughs> yes. Um, this fish can go to about, um, say, two feet if kept well. This is just like a baby. And so, um, and they are aggressive fishes. Okay. So if you notice, they just keep jumping even into the air and out. So um, we have to do it carefully. Okay. So that it doesn't jump out. Because if it does, oh you may God. have to catch it with the hand. Ah! <laughs> <laughs> right. okay. you know Please, I can do it. Please. Yes, you can. With God, all things are possible. <laughs> <laughs> okay, so you can hold it this way right. and just introduce it in there okay. gently. Okay, guys. Woo! <coughs> <laughs> Yes, and just pour. Pour rapidly. Good. <laughs> I did it! I did it! I did it! Oh. Hi, fishy! Oh, this is so cute. And I'm there, come with Oh! <laughs> so, oh. fish have got yes. their own feet okay. too as well. Come it's right to always get the right feet for the right fish. Um, and so, this is a koi. Uh, this is a koi fish. So uh, um, around the country, I think, there are some aquarium shops that do sell koi fishes, koi fish feed, so as well. So try to get them, and then it will be of good help to your fish. Uh, feeding your fish bread, crumbs, and all that doesn't really help because they turn up settling in the water and create so much weight. Thank you very much. I think we will, we will, we will organize a fish, fish care. <laughs> how, to, how to take care of fish. Yeah. Uh, so that you 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 teach us now, but this great. is beautiful. This thank you. This, this is beautiful. This is great. You know. So guys, it's, it's it's something simple you can actually practice. Okay. And then he's also more into that. Okay. So please, if someone wants to contact you, get one of these beautiful things. And please, I would love that you give out yeah. um um your 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 handle. Okay. And then your number as well. Maybe great. you can okay. contact you. So um, my Facebook handle is Water in Metal, Irigo Water Fountain. Wait, Water in Metal? Yes. That's actually how I call my fountains. Oh, I see. Yes, because <laughs> they are metal fountains, actually. Okay. Yeah, so Water in Metal, Irigo Fountain. And on my Instagram, it's Benji underscore Kweku. Okay. Yes. And then the contact is 54 
Okay. So please yeah. um, get this on the screen for us. Please take it for the last time. Zero five four zero four nine eight two one six. Okay. So um, do you have do you have a shop actually a shop that maybe? Uh, no, I don't have a shop now. Okay. Um, but I work from the house. So okay. Yeah, all right. That's great. So um, please um, kindly pick the number and yes. contact Benjamin. Get yourself a nice aquarium. Uh, get yourself a nice fountain, get yourself so your profession should be a video. Oh yes, if you want to be sure. Maybe I'm a person here to lap the nana. No, Tilapia is not an aquarium fish. Please. So. Also, <laughs> oh, post Postal is not part. Postal is not part. Uh, so, um, please take the contacts and then you can yeah. you can always uh, get in. Yeah. 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 Guys, I mean, I put a fish <laughs> into the bowl. <laughs> I, I am, I am, uh, I don't know. Yeah, yeah, point, I'm feeling that way. I'm too excited to even talk. Wow, so um, he's jealous. Not my yeah, yeah, jealous. <laughs> All right, so um, Ben, before we go, um, yeah. maybe there is someone also out there, since you're an mm. artist, you know, someone coming up who is also blessed with something, yeah. with the gifts and part of talents, you know. What um, do you have for such people, you know, and, okay. and, and, and a little advice? Great. Right. So thank you. Um, um, out there for the artist, for the artist, is not as easy as people do see it, because art is subjective, and, and what is nice to you is not nice to uh, me. So... Um, I'm only saying just do your best and always try to make meaning out of what you do as an artist because um, if you don't, people may mock you for something you might have the best of all the ideas for. And so um, don't be discouraged by the customer and his or her. it's not nice and it's nice and it's too costly. I mean, you know the worth um, um, of your work and how worth, uh, how worth it it is for you to, to always stand up to whatever thing you want to do. And, this, and then you have been able to produce such work. Nobody should be able to discourage you. I mean, step forward and be bold, come up. Because uh, here in Ghana, people don't want change. But you would always push with the change. And that begins with the artist. And so it's about you. It's about the work you're producing. It's about the impact you're making um, to others. And it's about how much money you can make out of it. Yeah, so do your best and don't be discouraged. It's difficult, yes, but don't be do discouraged. Do your best and don't be discouraged. Yeah. All right, so um, I think, yeah, our, our, our fountain is from here. I'm taking it. Our fish, our fish is calling for me. <laughs> yeah. All right, so um, this is how far we will... Uh, sadly, guys, sadly, guys. <laughs> We would have to take leave of yeah, you yeah, all yeah, 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 and yeah. meet you next Friday, God yeah. willing. It's been amazing. amazing. Today I'm taking a fish home, hey, an no, aquarium home. I'm taking the fish home. Okay. 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 You okay take fine. The no. And, and take no. Yeah, I'll take the aquarium. You take the fountain. No, no. I, I, I'll, I'll take the fish. No. I fish like is not in the bed to Okay, yeah. guys, it's been amazing and it's been beautiful. Yeah. Okay, and we love you all so much. Thank you for sure, tuning sure. in. Yeah. Thank you for subscribing. Thank you for sharing. Thank you for commenting. And we hope to see you guys next Friday. Yeah, so um, next week, another mind blowing creativity. Oh, yeah, you know, next week, yeah, Charlie. I, hey. You don't see this anywhere, it's only on Creative Hub. Mm -hmm. This is where we discover mind blowing creativity, mind blowing things. All right, so. um. I want you to show us love, okay? After the show, you can continue to share, drop your comments, show some love to Benjamin. And then you can also pick the numbers or contact him if yes. you need anything. Please, if you're an artist out there, I keep saying you would love to be on the show, kindly connect with us. Connect. Kindly what? Connect. Please, let's connect. No, this is a commercial. <laughs> <Let's connect laughs> right. Shout out to Americans. So, yeah, kindly contact us. If you also want to sponsor this show or you want to advertise your product, you can also contact us as well. So we are glad to, to, to really have your support. Thank you, guys. Thank you very much. Thank and, you all, guys. Uh, until next time, stay safe. Stay safe, guys. I don't want to leave. All right, thank you, Benjamin. You You're welcome. And thank you for having me. Benjamin, so yes. about, let's talk about this one. Who's taking it home? <laughs>